Hey everybody, Steven here, playing Subnautica Below Zero, and today looking at the latest updates to the game. I'm gonna do a new game here. I haven't covered this, it's just something that was super subtle, but when Cal starts talking in the intro, you hear a couple cracks here and there to make it sound more like he's over like the radio or an intercom. Subtle change, um, that's not the... Uh, the other thing isn't big either, but it's not the big thing within the intro. If you could pick it up, very subtle. The research is in everything. It is to me and Sam. I need to know what happened. The meteor storm. I just noticed they removed her gloves. Also, she had gloves on there for a little bit. If I remember correctly. Yeah, I want to say she actually had gloves on and now she doesn't. So the next one is just the icon for the shuttle computer. Should pop up. There we go. Shuttle computer. So I'm assuming they'll update that image because right now it's just a question mark. So we have that. Next. Welcome to 4546. Uh, let's go into the options. They have finally added. I was. I've been hoping they would actually do this for a while now. They have an FPS cap. Right. Uh, for some reason, it goes up to 500. I don't know who's pulling 500 <laughs> FPS. Maybe they're just future proofing, but I don't know who's pulling 500 FPS on their computer. You do have to have VSync disabled to allow for this. So if you have VSync on, it's not going to work. Wider on that, by the way. So we have that. I think that was the only change in here. Yes. Oh, actually, sorry. Um, Right underneath, displays, if you have multiple displays, right? You can change that. All right, so we have that. Enjoy your stay. A lot more bug fixes, um, animation updates, things like that. Uh, let's actually do story. Let's do the second interaction with Margaret. Warning. Warning. 200 meters. Couple Passing new lines of dialogue from the PDA as well. Please. Actually, there's a lot, but to highlight one of them here, it should pop up. I think it will. Might not now. We'll go close by and see if it does. But it, it's talking about the Mercury 2. Around for a second. So she talks to us. The woman in the exosuit has been traced as far this as is new. technology will allow. Signal location uploaded to PDA. So we have that. Is she gonna talk? Uh, she says, get off my land, Altera. I told you to stay off my land. You trained that thing? Requesting an alternate portion of dialogue there, too, Altera. if you notice that. I'm not with Altera. I'm Robin Ayu. I'm looking for information about my sister Sam. I think you might have crossed paths. Bull crap. I suggest you take the time you need to come to your senses and then get off my sea base. If you're not Altera, why don't you disable that damn tracking satellite tower instead of barging into my sea base? Maybe once Altera's off my back, I'll remember something about your sister. There's some junk on that table that might help. I couldn't get it to work. And so the big update with this is the fact that they have both of their dialogues with this, or their voice work with this. Last time I showed it, was it like a week or so ago, uh, it didn't actually have that. I, it only had, I believe, it was just one of them. I can't remember if it was, it was Margaret or, or Robin, but it just had one side of dialogue. And let's, I think it changed this on me, yeah. There we go. New blueprint synthesized. 
that's yeah not new blueprint discovered new blueprint synthesized <laughs> so let's see if we can get this bit of maybe it'll allow us to do it oops uh, of course it did that I don't know if it's gonna pop in We're just gonna run along the edge here. <laughs> Detecting stern of an there it is. Voltron's cough vessel nearby. Vessel name Mercury 2. Inoperative. There it is. So that's new. Go back in the free cam. So like I said, there's actually more than that, but that's one of them. Let's go over to Research Base Omega, because they have updated the outside portion of this where the platform is, right there. I'll bring my water boiling back on. So we have plants here now. Nice adjustment to this, it looks really good. Adds a little bit more life to it, right? And then with this also... There is a large anomalous mass of rock that has broken away and risen above... That's new as well. Green. Swim charge fins. New blueprint synthesized. So we have that. You still can find the control room um, data box in there as well. So we have that. Then we are going down towards the crystal caves so I know I've mentioned it but to mention it again they do plan on updating the crystal castle and the area really where you're gonna find one of Alan's body parts should be the is it the tissue sample or the organs um, but with this let's speed this up um, I don't know how much they're going to rework that they've done a little bit already one of the big things with this is they've actually removed the chandelier so I don't know if that's coming back I don't think that's gonna be a tech scan anymore and they've vastly improved the crystals i do like they mentioned this on favro which was like to make them more crystally <laughs> question mark right like and they do they definitely look more like crystals let's see so they do have the pillars down here the textures have been greatly improved down here that's something i saw that was addressed on the subnautica changes twitter account was an improvement in these textures looks really good especially in the lighting there just like the bump mapping with it but we used to have a chandelier up above us that is no longer the case it would have sat right here that is gone I guess it just didn't play into the story anymore no need for it so but yeah it's looking good Got diamonds right there let's go through here um, on my Discord, somebody asked if the textures on the ground were new. Somebody said no. I don't remember them being in these areas, though. So I guess just something maybe I was looking at and just didn't recognize. But it does seem like they have updated the ground to me through here, right? So maybe I just didn't recognize it. But to, to me, it, it seems like this is new. Like I said, this particular portion where it's basically like the crystals underneath the floor there. The ground. Yep, same thing right here. That goes along with the increase in textures and the look of the ground in general. So yeah, this should be improved in here, I believe. 
I don't know if that means kind of what this is in is going to change or anything like that. That may all stay the same, and, and maybe they were just saying the update that they just did to this was really what they were doing. Um, I'm hoping for maybe a little bit more, just to make it a little bit more interesting in here. Not that it's not with the crystals. Ooh, that's being pulled out. So maybe this is kind of the start of it. Yeah. We'll see. But I don't know. I don't know if it needs plants or something just to give it a little extra. But if you guys think of something that you would like to see down here, let me know in the comment section. So we have that. Then... Let us... Zoom over to let's see where am I going? We can head down to the fabricator caverns now. There we go. So they have finally finished out what used to be a tunnel going back to what is now the warp gate base. Um, they block that off when they change the story. Well, they've opened that back up and it just kind of goes to an end now. But there's not that. It just looked awkward with just the wall there. Of just like crystal. <laughs> so that's kind of. And I'd say it was about here. So yeah, this has been opened up. There was a shadow Leviathan in this area when it was the tunnel back. Um, that has been removed. So yeah, we have that. Don't think they'll do anything with it. It's just here. Kind of do miss the tunnel system back to the warp gate base, though. And then, of course, we have the fabricator base right here. Animations with this have been updated. I haven't checked yet. It would be subtle stuff. I don't want to get into that at the moment. So we have that. Oh, let's go back up. Uh, and actually, I should have ghosted in on this it's not a hundred percent new but I don't think I've actually highlighted this let's go right here the da, da, let's see music biome there we go so this is the Crystal Cave Castle. The track is the vocals. Adding emergency shelter blueprints to your data bank. And this reminds me of Halo. A test override module. Then I can disable that satellite tower. Yeah, very With subtle, but tool, you can I like this track. From raw materials, advising against exploring a frozen water continent without a base. No bed, no storage, no place to put a fabricator module, no fun. Keep talking over it. There you go. It's not incredibly long. All right, I have a scanner. <laughs> but I like the sound of it. here I don't think I can do or to be can I do thermal down here <laughs> yeah it's not gonna be enough there's no heat down here all right um let me change that up There we go. I always forget which one it is. There we go. Okay. All that just to show you the executive desk. <laughs> there it is. I was hoping they'd put that in there, right? It's gonna look odd against the rest of the base, though. I think when you can line out beds and things like that, it'll look better. It's 
Still don't have an icon for the executive toy or Parvan's bed, which is still my favorite. Got that shirt, by the way. I'm hoping these get updated. They look a little off compared to the other ones for the bathroom stuff. But I think that is it. Look at that view. That's a view. Whoa. Upside down, threw me out of the base. <laughs> there we go. That's a solid location for a base. <laughs> That's actually going to be it for this one. A lot of subtle stuff. Uh, as we're approaching the end of the week, um, I was hoping we would have the update this week for the stable build, but it doesn't look like that's going to be the case. They're just still working on a ton of different um, bugs and making sure everything's working smoothly with everything. So usually they go into lockdown before just so somebody checks all the code and everything like that, and we haven't had that happen yet. So fingers crossed. I know it'll happen before the end of the month for sure, <laughs> um, but I was kind of hoping it would be this week. So maybe next week maybe the week after at the latest. So we'll see with that. But that's actually going to be it for this video, everybody. If you like the video, hit the like button for me. If you want to continue to follow along with all my content, hit the subscribe button for me. Thanks so much for watching.